And I'm gonna get it on my own, my own stuff, my own videos. You gotta, whatever you want us to see, you gotta use the stuff that you got. Work with the stuff you got to get to where you wanna be. You hear me? You know, shout out to the people who really are true supporters and really rock with us and just give us nothing but positive feedback and you know what is good my lovelies and welcome back to the channel you guys i am back with another video and as you can see by the title today i'm going to be talking about how to be successful on youtube what it was like during my youtube career and just really how to just really be successful on youtube but before we get the video started make sure you guys subscribe and turn on those post notifications i'm thinking about doing a post notification shout out so if you guys would like that comment down below and i might start doing that to answer to do that you must be the first person to comment on my videos and that means you have to be subscribed and have your post notifications turned on so you guys can be notified every time i upload i really like doing sit down videos and i thought i could do this one you guys but i am so excited because my i have my youtube plaque really, it came in the mail and i'm so excited i feel like it might be little to some people but i feel like this is a really big thing to me and i'm just really happy and just very grateful as you guys can see it says lauren love you guys that is my influencer social media name but i am so just grateful and very excited to get this this is my personal plaque we also have our youtube plaque which we got when we hit a million like this is like y'all got dirt in the break because from when i was in the kitchen <laughs> but you guys can see this one says jewel and lauren but i'm just so grateful to like really have these plaques you know shout out to the people who really our true supporters and really rock with us and just give us nothing but positive feedback and you know because everybody's in touch with their own opinion but it's just you know we've been getting a lot of negativity but we just really are really just i'm just so grateful to really you know be as successful as we are on youtube you know i feel like in the youtube career sometimes you may get discouraged or it's just like your channel is not going as you plan just don't give up and i feel like two for the main components to succeed on youtube you have to like really kind of know what you're doing you got to get like hip to all the trends and me and joelle never really had a big collab with any big youtubers we've always been so independent and just really got it on our own me and joelle are definitely very humble um we always get like this misconception about us there's always stories accusations made that are not true but i feel like we're only human at the end of the day you know just like anybody else but i'm so grateful to you just be like you know where we at on youtube because i know there are people out there that work nine to fives there's you know there's no people that work nine to fives and just you know bust their butt you know shout out to you guys that really bust your butt and i feel like i really i feel very blessed and very grateful to just be able to do youtube it's the easiest job in the world but it's also a lot of difficult dif it's like it's also the really but it's also a very difficult career um that's what, that's what they said it's really good but it also can be very like mental it also can be a lot of toxic mentalness on your health and your well-being. Um, the camera literally cut off, so I don't even remember what I was saying. But um, it is basically like, I feel like YouTube, being like a YouTuber, you have to deal with a lot of opinions on you. And it's like, you know the real you, but, you know, that's the part of being on social media, though. You have to be able to handle the negativity and just a lot of things. But it definitely can have a mental... Toll. It definitely can take a mental toll on your health and just your your mental health, you know So that's why I feel like YouTube is honestly you really have to have fun and just really truly enjoy you have to really have fun Y'all my camera literally keeps dying Um, I keep forgetting what I was talking about. I literally had to charge the camera, but I think I was just talking about how you really have to just enjoy YouTube and uh, sometimes it's like you get discouraged and you see like People doing numbers on their videos. It's just like you really get discouraged, but you really have to just enjoy YouTube because I feel like the more you enjoy it, the less stressful you get. That's like, I feel like our content is very good. I feel like we put out very good content, especially for the family channel, for my channel, for the main. We put out very good content. Um, so I feel like, yeah, you know, at first we was doing pranks, but I feel like it's good to step away from the pranks. We've just been trying to stay away from the pranks, you know. It's funny pranking each other, but I feel like it's, you really get to see like our personalities once we're like doing different stuff but um i wrote some notes down on like just the different topics i wanted to share with you guys and two um also to like if you want to be successful on youtube i feel like you were definitely it's good to do it with somebody you know like a girlfriend that you have or like a boyfriend or just family i feel like um your youtube channel could definitely be better if you have like somebody else in it so it's different personalities because i feel like people who watch like youtube they, they want to see different personalities so if you like our like vlog style or like just you know different topics i feel like when you go into youtube you, when you go into youtube you definitely want to have like a main um entertainment like 
um, what is it called? A name entertainment brand. Like if you're fashion, beauty, um, vlog, prank. Like, you know, I feel like when you go on YouTube, you definitely want to know, like, what topic you're in. Um, but I was also just saying, too, like, for me, like, I'm such a passionate person. So I feel like whatever I do, I want to be great in it. I want to be the best in it. And I just want to, like, put up the best content, you know? So I feel like I'm really passionate and I'm just like, whatever I do, I just, I just want to really just, you know, take pride in it and just be really just passionate about it, you know? I'm just a very passionate person. I'm passionate about the people in my life. Um, I'm passionate about my friends, family, whatever it is, you know? I'm just, I'm very passionate about it. I'm a very caring person. I'm very, very caring. Um, but, yeah, and you definitely want to have bright content, like, you know, nothing dark. You want to have, like, as far as, like, lighting, um, you definitely want to have, like, a bright, cool, and I feel like, too, like, um, people, when they watch YouTube, they want to see something different, like, if you're doing something cool or, like, on a vacation, I feel like people want to see them because it's, like, it's something not average. It's something that they're not doing, so they want to see it on YouTube, but... Um, oh yeah, um, and also another topic I was writing down in my notes is clickbait. I feel like a lot of YouTubers clickbait, but I feel like you can't really get mad at people clickbaiting because it's like, it reels you in to watch the video, you know? I feel like people always get mad like you clickbait it, but I feel like it's fun clickbaiting because it's like, oh, I want to see what happens. Like, oh my God, this happened. It's like, I feel like it's fun because I feel like it's okay because it really triggers in um, you to watch the video. If you were to say something boring and it's like no one will really watch it, like if you said the whole thing in the title, they're not gonna watch the video because they already know what happened. So I feel like clickbait is definitely a good, and I feel like it's a, I feel like it's an okay thing for YouTubers to do. And also too, I was saying like, um, I wasn't saying, but I put it in my notes, like um, as far as networking, like don't be afraid to network. Um, I feel like as far as social media, or just if you wanna get anywhere, I feel like you definitely have to network with people that are doing what you're doing to really, you know, up your career and just really like, Whatever you do, like you want to network, whatever that whatever people are in your circle, you know. So, I, mean, I feel like me and Joel definitely never really had like we don't really collab. It's like we really just get on our own, you know. We're really about that. Um, we don't, you know, we don't kind of collab chase. We've always all our views we literally got on our own, you know. So I do, I definitely take pride on that. Um, I know some people just clap chase and just you know use people for title. We really just we really do our own thing, you know. And I'm just really I really take pride on that. I really do. Um, but um, also too, I was I wrote down in my notes: be ready to lose friends and f and also come across fake people. So um, as you like become more successful, you're definitely going to lose friends. I've lost so many friends, literally. Um, they do say they, they they do say that for some people, it definitely can get lonely at the top. That's for some people, you know. Drake's line: "Just me at the top, it isn't lonely, dog. Mm -hmm. Everybody acting like they know me, dog. God, shoot, mm -hmm. y'all, that was random." <laughs> But yeah, definitely, I feel like it's different for different people or different stages in your life. Um, I feel like you do lose friends as you become more successful. Everybody has like their own definition of successful. Like, you know, some people might be like, oh yeah, I made it, I'm good. Some people might be like, oh, I'm not satisfied with where I am. So I feel like you definitely have to be ready to lose friends because people will get jealous and they just won't like you, you know? And so it's definitely, and then also too, you will come across with people like losing relationships, like someone ends up being fake phony a lot of things y'all a lot a lot of things that you would never expect from the people you would expect it. and it's crazy because the people closest to you i've had to deal with the situation a lot my whole life i don't know why but i've definitely had some altercations with my relationships for real but um yeah that's pretty much it you guys i'm just so happy and grateful i got my plaque you know 100k subscribers i think i'm at 150 i don't know i'm about to check right now you guys I'm actually about to check. I literally had to email YouTube and ask them for my verification. Um, I'm waiting for my check mark, so I got 152k subscribers. So my subscribers are not that high, but it's okay. I'm gonna get it on my own. No clout chasing, none of that stuff. You know, none of that, none of that collabing. I'm gonna get it on my own, my own stuff, my own videos. You gotta whatever you want us to see. You gotta use the stuff that you got. Work with the stuff you got to get to where you wanna be. You hear me? I'm being serious, y'all, for real. So I'm just really happy, though. I'm just very happy, very grateful. I'm very grateful to be YouTube, doing YouTube. I really enjoy doing YouTube. Like, I love putting out videos for you guys. I just really enjoy it. Like, I really have a passion. I know Joelle's just kind of been like, I know you guys don't really see Joelle. Joelle's just kind of, you know, we just, I feel like this relationship, too, you got to, like, you guys are growing together. So you guys kind of give each other space. So I feel like you, Joelle has, it gets stressful for both of us, you know. So I feel like Joelle definitely has, like, been, 
has gone through stuff like with being so like disappointed with YouTube because YouTube can definitely be a roller coaster. Being an entrepreneur is a roller coaster. One year, one month you're making this money, the other month you're making not as not as much as you were making, you know. So YouTube is a huge roller coaster. I don't think people understand that, but yeah, I'm definitely grateful and I feel very blessed to be able to, you know, record my life for a living, you know, and just really have fun. I just, I'm so grateful you guys, I really am. So, shout out and thank you so much to all the supporters that truly support us and truly rock with us, you guys. You guys see me from the gutter, the ground up to where we are now, you guys. I'm so grateful and just so blessed, like, to be where we were to, you know, how we were. Um, me and Joel got together, we had a vision, we had a plan, and we really just set ourselves to it, you know. We're both so, so grateful and just, as a relationship, we're just growing together. You know, no one's perfect, but... I feel like in life you definitely have to reevaluate yourself and just really do what makes you happy. Life is real. I said this in another vlog. Life is really about just having fun and doing, really doing what makes you happy. Being around people, loving people. Like I really, I really believe that being around people you love and just really having fun can really just make your whole life. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I am out for lovely. Make sure you guys follow me on my socials. Um, so yeah, you guys, I am out. Ladies, now is the time to live your best life, look and feel like a queen by shopping my first live at laurenlovecollection.com.